Happy Timu Collab Day. Hi and welcome to our channel. My name is Tracy. Clay and Vanda aren't with me right now, but if you're new, welcome. Thanks so much for checking us out. We do all kinds of unboxings, unbaggings, get ready with me's, collaborations just like this. So if you're into that kind of thing, please hit that um, subscribe button. And if you're returning, thank you so much for being a part of our YouTube family. So uh, Miss Jackie Russell reached out and asked if anyone would be interested in doing a Timo collab, not PR. I don't get PR. Not that I'm not salty about that. I do not get PR from Timu. I applied. They said, you're in. Hit this link to get $50 worth. I hit that link and it was like, no. So I emailed them and they were like, oh, no, we made a mistake. You're not going to be on PR. Okay. Um, it's a little salty. But, so this is not PR. So I don't get any PR from them. Um, you, it couldn't be PR. It didn't matter what you spent, but you could only pick 10 items. Um, it took a while. Usually it gets here pretty quick. They did offer a $5, um, credit. So I believe I got that because you were supposed to get, or maybe not because I think today I'm filming this on March 29th. This was the deadline. Um, if they didn't get to me by this day, I might've gotten the $5 credit. Anyway, I'm not really sure, but, um, I did pick, I actually picked more than 10. So I'm only going to show you 10 items, but at least one of the items isn't here yet. That one was back ordered. So, um, if you're not familiar with Timo, which they're all over YouTube now, um, they are like the new Shein or Wish. Um, they are a company out of China. Um, I thought they had a warehouse in Dallas, which is how things got here so quickly, but then this thing cleared customs. So now I don't know, but I thought I had read that they did have a warehouse in Dallas, which is how they get things to you faster. Their prices are amazing. Um, I did screenshot everything so I can put the prices of what I paid for it. And I'm just going to take a moment, take out my items, count my 10, and show them to you. I think I got 13 in total, so it wasn't much too bad. Okay, so I have my 10 items out, and I am only missing one of the items. Um, I did order some dog stuff, um, just some collars. So I had, I ordered like a couple light up collars. One of them didn't show up. Um, I did order like a thing to snap your dog in. So those aren't exciting items. So I'm just going to put those, snap them into the car, you know. Um, so I'm just going to put those aside. So what you're going to do is you need to subscribe to everybody who's in this collab. Right now when I'm filming, I'm not 100% sure who's actually going to end up being in it. Because I know at least one person said, listen, I needed this by a certain time. I didn't get it. So I'm out. I'm not going to be able to do this. I asked for a refund because I wasn't going to get the items in time, which I certainly understand. Like she didn't want to just buy things for the sake of buying things. I did get stuff for my daughter and my husband um, for Easter and for Father's Day. So, and then I got some other things. But, um, so, you know, I didn't want to get things just to get them either. They were things that I was like, well, I'd like to try that. Um, I did get some fashion items to see what that was like. But the group of us, we were put together by Miss Jackie Russell. There's a group of us in there. Um, everybody will be linked down below and there will be a playlist. And you have to subscribe to everybody. you got to follow all the rules. You know, I only have one thing I'm going to tell you you need to say. I am sub to all. That's my magic sentence, because if you're saying I am sub to all, there's a pretty good chance that you are sub to all. Because otherwise, if you're telling me you're sub to everybody and you're not, that's really wonky. So I figure most people won't do that. Some will, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to double check, but at least I have a better shot of knowing that you are sub to all. And if you don't put that in there, I know that you um, both don't want to participate or whatever, maybe you do want to participate, but you don't want to be subscribed to everybody, whatever it is, but I know that you have opted not to participate. So, which is totally fine too. Um, 
most of the people though you'll be familiar with like you probably already are sub to them all right rate my haul from one to ten please that doesn't mean anything it's just like you letting us know how you think we did what you think of our items um that doesn't that's just bragging rights you know if you get like a bunch of tens you're like hey i got all ten um to me these are if they're good quality they're tens and if they're not then they're not tens but these were all things that i was interested in okay so enough talking um the first thing i got is a t-shirt for my daughter and i thought this was super cute is that kind of like all one so these don't really wash well i told my daughter because i got her one um with the mystery machine but like all horror characters i said don't put it in the dryer um but this i thought was super cute so it says you ask a lot of questions and it's got that adorable axolotl on there and because she is a budding marine biologist i thought that was super cute and she wears everything super big so what size did i get i got a extra large um because she likes everything big and plus i don't know how well those are gonna wash if they might shrink up and i only i only wash stuff like that in cold like my sheets and my towels i wash in hot but um the stuff like that i would only wash in cold anyway okay next i was interested in seeing what these were like so these are some tiles and they're like for the kitchen and if you see my kitchen is ugly as all get i do want to resurface the cabinets and make them blue and i'm going to paint the walls white um or a white shade so i thought you know give these a try see what they're about see what they're like um or i might put these in my bathroom which I'm going to do a, um, like a, a blue and gray kind of theme. There's a few different designs, as you can see. Oops. There is a little tab to pull this plastic sheet off the top. I don't want to pull it off too much, but I do want to kind of show you the quality because these were super cheap. So if I wanted to order a bunch of them, I could. I don't know. I think that could kind of work. I think it would look kind of cute without having to have a big cost. Next, I got something for my mom. She's about to have another surgery, and I thought this would be a nice recovery activity for her. So this is one of those diamond painting things, but it's got a border collie, and that is their dog they have a beautiful border collie love her she's so sweet um she hates bandit but that's her only flaw uh, but i thought this might be something she might do while she's recovering everything should be in there sounds like it is so yeah i thought that would be cute for my husband for father's day from my daughter i got this shirt that says i never dreamed that one day i'd become a grumpy old man but here I am killing it. So now again, this is that very plasticky kind of one piece. Um, it's not like a screened on. It's definitely like a, it's like those old eighties iron ons that, you know, it never lasts forever, but, um, yeah, yeah for what to pay for it, I guess, you know, you get what you pay for. All right. Next is a top for me that my daughter will also take from me. Um, but I kind of wanted to see what their fashion items, like what the fabric was like, if they were super polyester or not. Um, so I got this little tank top and it's got this ombre. They actually had a couple of other colors, but they didn't have it in a larger size. I got the extra large because I thought that they might run small, um, but it looks like they actually run pretty true to size. But that's all right because I could kind of like tie that at the end. Um, the fabric's not bad. It's soft. It's definitely not like I just did a wannable and tried on some 78 and sunny. It's it's not 78 and sunny quality. I'll definitely tell you that. Um, but it's not super polyester, but it's definitely got like a little bit of that polyester feel in it. But I think it'd be soft enough to wear. Like it doesn't, it doesn't feel like something out of the 70s. When I think polyester, because I know most clothes that you think are cotton are now polyester. But when I think polyester, I'm going back to those 70s polyester. So when I say that, that's what I mean. All right, for my daughter for Easter, I got her a mystery machine pin because 
We are Scooby-Doo fanatics, Hal and I, so I thought that would be so cute. I got her a headband, so there was different ones you could choose from. This was super cute. So it's like a little bandana headband, and I thought she would like that. Like, I thought she would really get it, have fun with that. So, um, yeah. And if she doesn't like it, I can put it on Kinsey as a bandana. <laughs> I got this for work because I share an office with my partner and we have quite the sense of humor. So, um, so I told him that I got this and that we were going to have to put it up. So this is like, it's a good quality. It's a metal sign. Um, and it says, if something here offends you, please let us know. We can all use a good laugh. I don't even remember what this is. It's another fashion item though. So this is like a tank dress and it says good vibes. And it's got like a big pocket here. So this is, oops, it's got some pockets. I can get my hand in it. So I thought this would be something Chloe could just kind of kick around in. This is, again, an extra large, because again, I didn't know how it would fit. Um, and it's got that plasticky. I don't really care for that, but it's otherwise like nice quality. I just don't like that plasticky because I just know how that washes. And then my last item um, were um, some paper liners. So they're kind of like coffee liners, but for your um, air fryer, if you want, or you could just, you know, anything at all that's going to messed up up instead of using a like sheet of aluminum foil you could put like you wanted to heat up something pizza or whatever you could put it on here and put it on your sheet pan um and keep it less messy and that's you know 100 percent me um i figured that the liners in an air fryer wouldn't be too bad because they're quite thin they're about the consistency of a um coffee filter so I thought that would be enough to let the air through if I did use it as use the air fryer function versus the silicone ones. I think the silicone ones have a place if you want to do baking in there, you want to make a frittata or something like that. I, this was obviously too thin for that, but um, yeah, I thought those were cute. So those are my 10 items. I got a little um, home, a little fashion. Um, yeah, let me know your thoughts. What, uh, what do you think? One to 10, how to do? Again, um, I, I definitely wouldn't give it a 10 because I don't like the plasticky stuff. But again, for what you pay for it, I guess that's not as big a deal. Um, but I do know that that is definitely going to start peeling um, once it goes through the wash. And I'm not going to put it in the dryer, so I'll make sure that uh, my family knows these don't go in the dryer. But I still think it's cute. Like, I still think that is super stinking cute. I don't think that they had it in another color. Um, cause I, or if they did, it was white and white and my daughter do not go hand in hand, but she would definitely kick around in this. So, and that's great to throw over a bathing suit in the summertime too, I think. Okay. Well, that's all I have for now. Please, um, check everybody else out, see what they got, give them a rating and make sure you're subscribed to all. And, um, I think all of the channels are having a giveaway. I don't even know what I'm going to put in my giveaway yet. I don't typically know until it's about time to do it and then I put something together or if I know the person and know that they like certain things I'll try to put those things in if I have any extras but um but there'll definitely be a giveaway it won't be a huge one but it'll be it just you know I always do a good one and I think most of the others are having a giveaway as well but check them out and um all of my roles are down below so make sure you check out those Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and I mean, you might as well hit the notification bell. You're hitting everything else down there. Why not? Right? It's a whole panel. Um, that's it. So hopefully, I'll see you soon.